1.15 a.m. <laughs> 7 a.m. Just got another coffee and I just slept for two hours. My turn to drive now. didn't have anything like that. All right, off to a coffee shop. <laughs> Cute little cafe. There's Julia, we're staying at her apartment in Dallas. <laughs> Getting ramen and they've cranked the music up on us. Haley wants to know if she's in a club. I see you. You ridiculous. We can't hear each other speak. Seven Eleven Dippin' Dots. Allie has a Twix bar. 9:33 p.m. I think the line. Yeah, about to do a Joshler Book Club. I think the line's at like 54 people. It's um. The 11th and the show is on the 13th. Okay, we had to resort to a Tom Thumb. No, you're such a hater. Sing. Okay, I've forgotten to vlog today, but we went and got coffee, and now we're on a little street <laughs> out in Texas. All right, going to some boutiques. Yeah. Flower child. Worlds colliding at a Mexican dinner. This is Julia, our friend from high school who we're staying with. Maddie and Haley. RIP to I'm Megatron 21. She last, wait, I can't include this. It'll have to be cut. You're gonna have to blur it out somehow. <laughs> anyway. It, it She's lasted, not that good of an editor. I'll have to just zoom in on her face. Okay, anyway. It lasted um, about 24 20 hours. 20, no, not even it's okay. I'm Megatron 2.0. It's going to come back and be stronger than ever. Uh, Saying our farewells to our nighty nights to Julia. Let's go get in the tent. Right. Good night. Bye, Julia. Thanks for being a great host. Yeah, thank you. There's something going on out here. I'm not sure what they're all lined up for. Roll down the window. Roll, down the roll it down. <laughs> That's so stupid. 5.30. I think we're about to walk over. For some reason, a bunch of police have showed up. Walking over. Good morning. 6:30 a.m. <laughs> 6:56 a.m. Maddie's ticket just transferred. We're literally standing up to get our tickets scanned to get wristbands right now. Let's go. That was almost bad. Just got our numbered wristbands. about to get in our little stalls. We're, we're pretty high numbers, but it's okay. Wow. It's alive! We've paid for parking for this spot, but we're about to leave. Um, but our parking's good till tomorrow morning, so Haley's about to put a cone in the spot. Yeah. <laughs> Against all odds, it is 3.30 p.m. Back in the line, eating our sweet green. This is the life. It's a little bit warm out. Pre show slay. Pre show slay. Just went to a CVS turlet. Um, going in in about 30 minutes. Here, everyone, get in this. And we're going Josh's side tonight, I fear, because it seems like everyone's going Tyler. So. Maybe it's we'll okay. be Josh I'm tonight. Yeah, no, I'm actually excited. I haven't gone his side in a very long time. This is six years in the making. <laughs> <laughs> 
Also, we're on Josh's side. <laughs> Surprise.
you sing a you sing a song and a lyric that you wrote so long ago and it means so much more to you. Uh, I'm just getting over my feelings tonight. I'm sorry about that. Welcome to our campfire. Man, I can't believe you guys know this many songs. It's kind of crazy. So, uh, do you mind if we play a few more acoustically before we rip it again? Yeah. The problem is, um, I need my ukulele and I left it out there. So, yeah, you please be gentle with her. Careful. She's young.
great group we have in here, guys. Thank you so much for coming to the show. I don't want to forget what it's like to go to a show. We travel all year long and we play shows, but man, sometimes getting to the show after the show, driving in traffic really sucks. And now that I've reminded you of that, please don't leave early. But we know that it requires more than just this amount of time that we're up on stage to, to be a part of this event with us. And we're very, very appreciative of that. Thank you guys so much for that. It means a lot.
about us. But um, that's not what I mean. What I mean is, uh, I think when I when I went to shows and I would watch some of my favorite bands, I always wondered they've been playing music for so long. Do they still like each other? I want you to know that we're best friends, man. I think maybe uh, some of you might think that we just spend some time up here on stage, smile at each other, and then go our separate ways. In some sense, that's real, but honestly, when we're on stage together, it's the least amount that we share our lives together, we talk together, we converse. I want you to know that whoever is that friend that's got your back, I want you to reach back out to them, make sure that they know you have their back too, because that's one of the most powerful relationships that you can have in this life. So go ahead and do that with you. I know, uh, we would love to come back sometime and celebrate with you again, so. I always like to point out that if it happens again, we'll be a little older. But you will too. So. So next time, you know, when Josh does his backflip off the piano, and he has a harness helping him do it. When you're laughing, you're also going to be laughing with bad knees yourself, so be careful. We're 21 Pilots and so are you. We'll see you next time. Peace. Um, Yo. hey guys. <laughs> There's been so, an unexpected turn of events. Okay, Just so, add the picture okay, wait, right wait. here. <laughs> okay. Boom. So, boom. 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 <laughs> okay, so. Back to the story. We went Josh's side tonight, and Tyler was looking at us, whatever. And then on his way back up from trees, he said, thanks for coming, and like smiled and high-fived us, which I didn't expect because we were Josh's side. Then afterwards, we were kindly escorted backstage. <laughs> Told no phones and put in a catering room. And then boom. Boom. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm really behind on making vlogs and it's currently July. It's 10 months post meet and greet and I'm making this vlog and realized that a lot of details were left out. So we're just going to do a little recap. Their security came up and was talking to us and kind of stalling and- They were just asking questions like how many shows we've been to and just waiting. And then he started talking to us for so long that at a certain point I just said, tell Tyler to bring meeting beats back because tonight it's my 60th show and I still haven't met him and that really caught him off guard and then a few minutes after that he was like all right I have some more questions for you guys maybe around the corner okay and so then we were brought to a catering room while we were walking back though he was like by the way you guys are going to meet him Tyler wants to say thank you yeah well okay and then one of the security guards ran up and said you've got the wrong group of girls send them back <laughs> and then another asked how we got back there and Allie said we snuck back um <laughs> And then we were brought to a catering room and talked to their manager for a little while. And then... And during all this, we were frantically trying to pick fake snow out of each other's hair. Because it looked like dandruff. And we weren't allowed to be on our phones, so we were trying to fix each other's makeup since we couldn't look at each other. Yeah. Or look at ourselves. And then they walked in, and it was a world stop moment. Tyler said something like, we showered quick for you guys. Not together, though. <laughs> and then... Okay. Then he said, um, I want to take, there was another group brought back with us because we didn't have a guy in our group and he didn't want it to be weird. So he said, he walked in, he's like, I want some pictures with the three amigos and some solo ones with them too. 
this is your time to shine. Okay, and so then something came over me. I'd met them in 2019, but I'd never actually gotten to introduce myself. So I walked up and I shook Tyler's hand, said like, I've never gotten to introduce myself, I'm Anna. And he looked like kind of shocked and confused. And, and like, he said, a handshake, that's all. Let's take the picture and then we'll hug. Everybody and, can do better, something like that. And I wanted to hug him, but I didn't want to be weird. I didn't want to have to ask. So that was honestly a perfect scenario. So, so we all shook Josh. I shook Josh, yeah, I shook both of their hands. And then we lined up in the order, Tyler, me, Haley, Allie, Josh, and we're like ready to take the picture. And then Tyler was like, no, I have an idea. Like, Let's make this know. cooler. Okay. Yeah. He rearranged us to where it was me, him, Haley, Josh, Allie, and we were like staggered. And then Josh said, <laughs> but now she's far from him because he knew that we were Tyler fans. Yeah. Family. And I was put on the outside by Josh, but I didn't care. It was really nice that he said that. Okay. So we took our pictures and then Tyler turned to us and was like, well, he hugged all of us individually, yeah. and then when we broke away from the hug, he said thanks for every, like, thank you guys for everything, and I cut him off, and I was like, no, thank you for everything. Yeah. We've been to so many cool places because of you, and yeah. just, like, yeah. stuff like we that. Yeah, we both got to say, like, wouldn't have done any of this without you. Yeah, and then he took pictures with the other group and kept looking over at us, um, and we got our solo pictures. And screamed at him, we'll see you in Houston tomorrow and it's crazy the end y'all just wait for this columbus vlog <laughs> back in julia's apartment <laughs> this is the weirdest night of my life there's raccoons on the roof it's it would have been normal for him to do that before a show like I've, i speak to him sometimes but after a show he's supposed to be with tyler and josh escorting them that's why when he was sitting there i was like this is strange <laughs> Wait, no, Anna, you know what we need to do? <laughs> Anna, get over here. Now, get over here. Do you want to go like this? Do you want to do it with me? Okay. <laughs> Anna, you look like you've never jumped before. Six in the morning. I think I slept about 45 minutes last night and time to drive to Houston. <laughs> okay, driving into Houston, um, my mom flew in and we're going to pick her up at the airport because then she's going to drive this car back home and we're flying out of here to San Francisco. Um, so about to go pick her up. Haven't seen her in about two weeks. Yeah. Okay, didn't vlog, but we picked my mom up, ate at a restaurant, and now we're at our hotel. Hopefully, can nap for a show tonight. I have cowboy hats on. All right, we took naps. It's like 5 p.m. now. No, actually, it's later. It's like 6, and we are about to walk to the arena. Tonight is a celebration of life. <laughs> This room's a nightmare. We've only been here for about two hours. Life does not get better than this, I it, fear. It doesn't. I'll never live a day as good as yesterday. Or this one. That's okay. My mom My mom was saying, what about the day you get married? What about the day you have children? It doesn't matter. <laughs> yesterday, no, that's it. It's because my 13-year-old self would be just as excited as, or more excited, honestly, as my current self. And I would just be more excited and like, always appreciate everything. I don't know what point you're trying to make right now. <laughs> I'm just saying, I don't know the man I'm marrying. I know Tyler Joseph since I was 13. <laughs> He's more important. Okay, it's about 7:20. Haley needed some safety pins for a dress. Like, we like are about Adam. to miss. We are about to miss Peter. Yeah, the start. After Uber. 60 shows, they took us backstage yesterday. You've been to 60 of their shows? Yeah, yeah. I've been to 60. <laughs> Make it right, make it right.
you Then we gonna stop with it You tell me nothing we would give you Not nah, is it time to move our feet To an introspective to beat it Ain't the speakers in my heart Time to make a Lean with it, rock with it Get it We're doing the seating section in the middle all the way around. You guys good all the way here? I appreciate you guys because um, you could sit down, but you're not. So, thanks. People who could not get away with it are right here in front of me, my people in the pit. My children. Are you good? You guys looking out for each other, right? All right. The show's not over yet. We have we have a few more to go. Um, we haven't played Ride yet. I mention that because uh, I get the vibe that there's a lot of dads in here that are like, I just like Ride. This guy right here, he likes Ride for sure. <laughs> yeah. Sir, do you you like Ride? Don't you? Yeah. But you have, you like more than. You like more than Ride, right? You, you like a lot of songs, yeah? Oh yeah! Shout out to dads who have their sunglasses on their croquis wrapped around their neck in the pit. Shout out to those guys. We're better than Dallas! I like Josh's sweater vest!
8.45 a.m. We're about to split up. <laughs> Three amigos go to separate ways.